If you've seen more coyotes than usual lately, there's a reason for it. Texas Parks and Wildlife says coyote mating season happens mid-January to early March. And with more coyote activity, it's a good time to remind pet owners to be mindful of their furry friend's safety. Here's Sydney Jolivet. Sibley Nature Center scientist Michael Nickel describes coyotes as highly opportunistic and adaptable. So the fact that they are seeing more coyotes in our area is not shocking or new. Coyotes have been here a lot longer than any humans. So uh, I, I guess you could say that uh, as we expand our living quarters, we're moving more into wildlife habitat and you're expected to find more coyotes and other types of wildlife. Nickel has heard of coyotes attacking pets in the past, most of those cases involving dogs. Take a uh, UTPB. Uh, there's, there's a nice walking trail out there, but they do have signs warning that there are coyotes present and to keep your dog on a leash. Mm -hmm. And so, yeah, uh, they're opportunistic, and if a, a little small dog that might be interested in a bigger dog-like animal, uh, and it could be lured away and uh, easily devoured. But attacks aren't the only danger household pets face from coyotes. In a recent case, Nickel saw a dead coyote that was later found to have distember, a viral canine disease. It's uh, especially severe for, for younger dogs. Uh, I've seen uh, uh, veterinary offices telling the, the, the visitors to keep their puppies off the floor you know, because they, they, there might be sick animals that have come through there, and so the puppy might be able to pick up a, a disease like mm -hmm. that. While coyotes may not be your favorite wild animal, they do play a role in helping our environment. Well, I don't want a coyote for a pet, but I don't want to see them all killed off either because they, they do provide a, 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 a function, a role in nature as, as being uh, uh, bed-level predators. So the best thing pet owners can do to keep their pets safe is to keep them close and on a leash. In Midland, I'm Sydney Jolivet, News West 9.